Hey everyone, Rumors is right here, and today we're gonna be playing Will You Press the Button? I hope you guys enjoy. <laughs> Alright, so basically the question is, you become the most powerful being in existence, but you wipe out mankind from existence. But I, nah. Cause w what's the point of being the most powerful person if no one, like there's nothing to, you know, like you're you're the only person that's alive, so. That's kind of dumb. I wouldn't press the button. Uh, you did not press the button. Uh, 57% didn't press the button. Alright. That was good. The cure for cancer is discovered, but it is found during your autopsy after having died of cancer. No. <laughs> I don't want to die of cancer. And I feel like, honestly, I feel like I feel like uh, the cure to cancer is already discovered, but people, every time people want to, you know, show that it's out there, I feel like they get hushed and stuff. I honestly feel like there is a cure, and there are, like, definitely, like, um, natural cures to things, for sure, that, I don't know, I just feel like it's, there's something out there. But that's just me, like, it, it could or could not be, but that's what I feel anyway. But I would not press the button. <laughs> uh, 26% did not- oh no, I'm a bad person for that. Uh, <laughs> Alright. You gain the ability to heal people, but you must personally murder your absolute favorite fictional character, but uh, who also happens to be the one person immune to your power. So I can heal people, but I have to kill my most- my favorite fictional character, who also happens to be the one person immune to your power. Hmm. Yeah, why not? I'll do it. I mean, it's whatever as long as they get healing powers. So, yeah, 63 people voted that. Not bad. You are God, but everyone is an atheist. I I wouldn't mind that. I don't care. <laughs> I can, I'll be God. You will solve the problem of global warming over population and starvation, but will live out the rest of your life alone and pe penniless. Nah, I'm not pressing the button. Screw that. <laughs> um... You can turn invisible on a whim, but every time you do it, your head <laughs> shrinks in a millimeter. Well, I don't have one, so GG to me. I can definitely do that. Your consciousness is transferred into an artificial intelligence network, basically making you a god. But you will be forced to continue until the end of the universe, meaning you will be the last thinking being in existence. Uh, uh, I mean, I just said I was gonna be a god, so so I, I don't mind being god, really. <laughs> 55%. You are a beautiful human being, but you are always 10 years behind technology. Nah, I don't really care about being beautiful or not. I would rather the technology. All the racist questions disappear from the site, but all the remaining questions are about waifus or Half-Life 3. Yeah, sure. I don't mind that, actually. You can bring one person back from the dead and they will live 25 years, but your lifespan will be reduced to 25 years. I will not. No. My life. They're already dead, like why would that really matter to them? You know, they've lived their life. I haven't, so. Might be a bad person for that, but, you know, I want to live my life. You will get free coffee wherever you go, but they will also get your order wrong. Um, I don't really drink coffee, so if I can get something free for free, why not? I'll do it. F 55 people say so yeah. 55%, I mean. You have the ability to make the impossible happen, but every time you do, 30 seconds of your life is taken. 
I actually really wouldn't wouldn't mind that if I can do anything, literally anything, at least 30 seconds of my life. I don't mind that at all. Who wouldn't? That's 80% people say yes. The Leafs win the cup, but every hockey fan grows a beard. <laughs> I don't care. I'm not a hockey fan, so... You can breathe underwater and withstand all levels of pressure, but you can never surface from underwater again. Uh, mm, I don't know if I would want that or not. It's like basically saying like, basically it's like you can be like a mermaid or I don't know what, technically, but you gotta stay in the water. Uh, nah, there are a lot of creatures. There are a lot of like scary creatures in the water. I would rather not do that because I don't want to be endangered, endangered like that. So, nah, I'm good. I'm good on the surface. You get any electric electronics you like, but you have no electricity. <laughs> well, what's the point of that? Why would I anyone want that? That's pretty dumb. Oh, someone said, I just realized you can sell them all. <laughs> that would make sense. You, but still, you would have no electricity, so what's the point of that? Anyway, you get to control the world, but the world explodes four years after it. Um, hmm. I mean, if I get to choose when I, I can control the world, then I would definitely choose it. I would definitely do it. Yep. 63% people did not. <laughs> you can have money without working, but you become deaf. No thanks. I, I like my hearing. You have the most beautiful voice and can attract anyone, but when you talk, you sing every single word you speak. No thanks. That would be so annoying. I wouldn't be able to hear myself. The Byzantine Empire is revived, but economically controlled by Jews. No thanks. <laughs> uh, Kurt Cobain will come back to life and make 20 more Nirvana albums, but the next five presidents will be Republicans. Uh, I don't even care, so <laughs> honestly I really don't care. Uh, you will be able to put yourself into any world slash alternate universe any at any time or any specific moment at your command, but you must stay there for at least one day and in every other world no one will be able to see or hear you. So you will be able to put yourself into an any world alternate universe at any time or any spe specific moment at your command. Okay, well, why would it why would that be bad? I don't see the downside as well. You get to meet any celebrity once a year for life, but you experience extreme back pain for a whole week after each visit. Uh I really don't care about celebrities honestly. So I will not I really don't care. <laughs> Uh, able to save specific dream so it can be experienced again once, but you'll never be able to dream anything else. Uh, so basically, you can relive one dream, but you'll never be able to dream anything else. That's pretty dumb. Why would I want that? <laughs> oh, some people are like, no nightmares. Meh, I'd rather have my nightmares and my good dreams, so... Instead of like not being not being able to dream anything, get a random ability and know everything about it. But the ability will have a random downside that only applies when you use the ability. So let me get this straight. Random ability that and know everything about it, but the ability will have a random downside that only applies when you use the ability. Uh sure, why not? I'll do it. I'll risk it. Alright, that is it for today. We have, like, 
we're like 10 minutes in so um hope you guys enjoyed that uh leave a like um if you guys want to see more let me know peace love and recycle